Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, so, a lot of people are asking the question, want to know, so what's happening with the SSDs, the solid state drives, and the latest Windows updates? And a lot of people were reporting that it seemed like the latest updates in Windows uh, 10, 11 was uh, kind of breaking SSDs or stuff. Uh, people are wondering, well, now, so what happened? Uh, it seemed to happen mostly on Windows 11, 24H2. And, uh, well, if uh, you uh, read some of those news that, especially this one here, KB5063878, seemed to be the culprit. Well, Microsoft says, nope, Windows updates are not to blame and nothing in the Windows updates is doing that. So what's happening exactly? Um, Microsoft says they have in-house PCs that they've uh, used and tried several different ways and with all the comments that people were saying and with the hardware that some people were saying and how they did it and that the SSD kind of disappeared. And um, they say that they can't recreate any of it. Um, and also, um, they've talked with SSD manufacturers and SSD manufacturers uh, and some of the um, OEMs, the, the companies like Dell and um, HP, also uh, did tests trying to recreate the issue, and nobody can. So Microsoft says it has nothing to do with Windows and it has nothing to do with the latest update. Uh, they are still looking at the data and the feedback from people about um, you know, what exactly could be the issue with that. But for now, they can't at all uh, see any um, relation between the latest update and some SSD problems. So it would uh, seem that, nope, the, the update does not do anything to, to create that. Now, of course, there are people having issues because all the people that are writing and they're, they're saying, well, you know, I've got that issue happening, I transferred big files and so on. Um, could it be somewhere else? Could it be, you know, maybe we should look at the hardware closer. Could it be a mix of SSD drives and certain machines? Because definitely not everybody's having it. And um, could it be just a match of a certain motherboard with a certain SSD drive and it does that? Well, that's a question that, you know, we got no real big answer. Um, so we'll see. I'll continue observing this uh, problem. And um, if anything else pops up, We'll talk about it, but for now, it does not seem that Windows is the problem behind disappearing SSDs. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.